safe and saucy, Patriot safety Obi Melifon Wu showed he knows how to handle that dough. The Super Bowl champ recently teamed up with Domino's, and locals caught him climbing behind the counter of the pizza chain's Westboro location. The NFL player got his hands dirty alongside sports agent Sean Stotto, all to help the store celebrate its annual Customer Appreciation Day. Sneak's Peak, Yvonne's will be channeling the spirit of Boston Art Week as it welcomes Boston-based artist Timmy Sneaks to its recently opened gallery May 2nd. A selection of Sneak's works will be showcased throughout the space, starting on the main floor and stretching down to Yvonne's new underground, rotating gallery, where his latest pieces will be installed. The local artist, whose vibrant street art has attracted the attention of national stars like DJ Khaled, will also be live painting at the event, so folks can sit back, sip on some cocktails, watch the master work and maybe personally get a taste of the art action. And once he's done, the finished products will be auctioned off, with proceeds benefiting the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation. Space at the event will be limited, and admittance will be on a first-come, first-served basis starting at 5.30 p.m. Oh my god, Italy Boston will soon be the home of a new eatery that sounds like a real culinary catch. The Italian market, located in the Prudential Center, is set to open La Pescheria later this week, when folks can sit down to an elevated bar experience centered around sustainability, traceability and, as its Italian name implies, fresh seafood from local sources. The establishment promises to offer a menu of fish from New England purveyors, Think Island Creek Oysters, John Nagel Co., Red's Best and Wolf's Fish, that will be prepared with a modern Italian twist and curated by Italy Boston's executive chef Sam De Los Santos. And for an added layer of flair, diners can have the store's fishmongers roll their carts of seafood from the fish counter to their table so they can see exactly what will end up on their plates before it's cooked. But hey, don't just take our word for it, see for yourself when the restaurant officially launches on the second floor of Italy on Friday. Let's block ads. Why?